girls and guys it is Sarah from Sai Let's Play and we are back with another episode of Minecraft PE and we've got lots to do again. So before we get started on what the heck this cobblestone mess is, I want to show you guys a couple of the changes that I made and some of the things that I found on my adventure. So if you guys remember, the semi-automatic farm used to actually be here, but I decided to move it over next to the barn because it just kind of made more sense having the wheat farm and the bar next to each other. Right now, it basically stayed the same. I made it a little bit longer, but it is a little bit narrower. Um, the little path that you stand on is a little bit narrower. Uh, so that it could fall flat with a barn. I might extend it out, but I'm not sure exactly how I'm going to do that just yet. So I'm going to leave it like it is for now. But I actually think that looks a lot better and it makes more sense. One of the ideas that I have is actually bringing this out further out and enclosing that and making like the wheat surround the front and just having a little path here. I think that'll be nice if you know what I'm talking about. Probably not. You're probably like, what the heck does she mean by that? But don't worry. My brain sometimes thinks that about myself as well. <laughs> What? I don't even know. <laughs> but let's give you a little sheepy update. Sheepy's doing fine. None of the animals have been killed. See, there they are. <gasps> I thought we had two horses. I thought we had two horses. The little polka dot one. Where did he go? Oh no. I think we have lost the horse. <gasps> let's pretend it, that it never happened. Let's pretend it didn't. So, um, also, on my little adventure, I didn't find much, but I did find a dark oak biome and a spruce biome. So what I did, instead of like chopping down a million trees, I chopped down one of each so I could get some saplings. And that's what, exactly what I did. So I got two there, and I've got some spruce here. Actually, what I'm going to do right now, so I don't forget, is I'm going to plant them right now so that they're fully grown and we always have a supply of the trees that we need so now the cobblestone that you guys saw at the start is actually going to be my house oh. so my little starter house is getting way 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 too small honestly i can't live there much longer if you go in there everything is so cramped up because um i have all my chest all over the place and stuff and i'm like i just can't live in this little itty bitty house anymore i just can't as much as i love it it's just not doing it for me anymore. So I was like, I want to build a house and I have a lot of ideas. I want this place to end up being like a town. I was going to call it a city, but I'm not going to build like streets and street lights and stuff like that. I just kind of want it to be more like a Minecraft town and everything is connected. So I was like, I want my house to be a good size, but not too big, not a mansion or anything like that. So I thought I'm going to put my house over there across the lake. That way I could see everything across you know the plains and it's gonna be beautiful but then i was like <laughs> i'm really lazy even in minecraft i don't like walking so i was like no 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 no, that's not gonna work so i decided to move it move it over to this side and it's actually not that bad that way everything is still going to be within walking distance and it's gonna all be connected by paths and bridges and stuff so we have our farms there we're gonna have our little brewing station there i plan to build two other things though so now that I have my house laid out here, I'll show you guys when I go like up on a tower what it's going to look like. But I want a shed and that's going to be where my storage area is. And I haven't decided whether I'm going to build it out in the back or if I'm going to build it over here in this area, like flatten this out a bit more and build a little shed. And that's where I'm going to keep all my supplies, more like a realistic house where you have your garage or shed on the side. And I want to build a greenhouse. I really, really do. I haven't like... It's something that I've never built before, but I think it'll be so cool. And I think, yes, I'm definitely going to do it. But before I start doing all of that, I need to build my house. So my enchantment table isn't out here. So I have places to walk. So that is the plan. So let me walk up a little bit so that you guys could see the floor plan for the actual house. I'll show you guys what materials we're going to use to build it. All of that good stuff. So this is going to be my dream home. So this is the floor plan. The front entrance is going to be right here. Actually, that needs to go back one. Dang it. And I could say like that. So that's going to be the front entrance. I really wanted to build like this little curvy part for a, a huge window that I'm going to put out there. And uh, I think this will definitely be the living room. It would make more sense. So the living room is going to be here. Maybe have like a little bar out at the back with our kitchen and dining room table over there, a stairway leading up somewhere so that we have an upstairs where our bedroom is going to be. So I think that's what we're going to do. Uh, we're going to finish off the floor plan and stuff, but I need to go to sleep so I don't die because mobs like to come out at night and I'm not trying to die. I really not. 
I was gonna say I don't see any mouse, but then all of a sudden I see a creeper. Oh my gosh, creepers be creeping! Let's go to sleep. <laughs> Let's go to sleep so we don't die. Dying is very dangerous. I'm just gonna tell you that right now. It's something that you definitely don't want to do. Minecraft tip number one. <gasps> There are a monster. Oh, it's time for us to get our sword out. We're gonna go on a little killing spree. Come at me. Oh, oh, oh. I just don't want it to be creepers. That's all. Die, 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 die. Oh, we killed it. That was very aggressive. Very unnecessarily aggressive. I did not have to treat that zombie that way. What? At one point, that zombie used to be a person. Oh, no. Oh, no, oh, no, oh, no. That zombie used to be a person. There we go. By the way, I turned on split screen. I did the opposite. Whatever it was before, I did the opposite of that because a lot of you guys were telling me to do that. Go to sleep. What do you mean there's monsters nearby? I killed all those darn monsters. You want me to kill some more? I will. Oh, oh, there's one. Too. Oh, he just wants to be invited into my house. You want to be my friend? Zombie? Do you want to be my friend? Do you want to come inside? My You're invited. You want to come inside? Come on. Let's go inside. We'll have a little, we'll have a little dinner. Come on. Do you want to come inside? Come on. I'm just kidding. You have to die. I'm sorry. That was very cruel of me. Very cruel. Just teased the zombie. He was like, you want to be friends? And then I just killed him. You'll never know. Maybe zombies have feelings. Maybe they do. But people just go and kill them so they never get to express themselves. So the house is going to be here. Now I'm going to use the stand to create the interior floor plan. Ooh, wish me luck on this one. So we're going to have... I want lots of windows. So the, here's going to be the door for sure. Do we want it to be too wide? We'll have it too wide. And I'm thinking this is going to be like the little loungy area. Maybe ha either turn this into a bar or a sitting area with some bookshelves and stuff. Kind of like an office kind of type of thing, but no desk. Just like we're going to have some bookshelves. And just a couple of couches and stuff. And then over here, we are going to have the living room come out to this part here. So living room, this thing here, we'll have a back door right over here. And for stairs, I'm so used to doing them in the middle. But I'm kind of thinking, let's switch it up a little bit. Why don't we put the stairs along here? So just so I know that I'm talking about stairs, I'm going to build just a little mini staircase like that because I will forget what the heck that was and I'll be like, what was I trying to do there? Was I trying to, what, what, what was I trying to do? You know, so I don't want to do that. Mm -mm -mm. Okay, so we have the stairs there and then we're going to have this area here which we need to figure out what to do with. I want to build a little attached patio because I think that'll be really, really nice. So what I'm going to do is along here, I'm not sure how this is going to look or how it's going to work out, but I really, really want this because I think it'll be really nice. So this is going to be the outdoor patio area. I might make it bigger. So that means I want this here to be like the dining room. And then like sometimes whenever it's hot, you could come outside and have dinner out here instead, that kind of thing. So this is going to be the dining room here. This is going to be the dining room. It's going to be a, a little bit bigger, of course, because that's too small, which means the kitchen should be over here, surely. Ooh, this is going to be a little bit tricky. I'm going to have to play around with this to see because I'm not sure how I want to do this. But let's start working on one wall just so you guys know like what style we're going to go with. So I did pick up a lot of clay as well while I was on my adventures because I wanted to be prepared. Preparing is very important in my life right now. So we're going to grab all our stuff that we're going to use. We're going to definitely need some more. Oh, we got spruce wood. That's what I wanted. Perfect. I feel like spruce wood is a little bit darker on Minecraft PE. I don't know if that's only me. So we've got our spruce wood. We don't have any glass. Oh, poopsicles. Oh, poop. And we just used the sand. Oh, man. Do we have any coal? Coal should be in here. We only have one piece of coal. Are you kidding me right now? That is not a lot of coal at all. We'll use whatever we can though, because we only need enough glass so I can show you guys what I'm talking about. So we also need quartz and we're gonna need quartz stairs as well. Oh, by the way, I almost died getting all of this quartz, but I didn't because I'm a survivor. That's what survivors do. Uh, let's get some stairs. 
There we go. Perfect. So we don't need a lot. We just need to get enough. Perfecto. So I need to put that in my inventory. We need this and we need these. So that's going to be the base color of our house. So we're going to let that cook while we go on to our building. By the way, building something so detailed like this is so difficult for me. I thought I was getting quite used to it, but nope. So the bottom um of the house like the edge of the house is going to be this cobblestone just to add some contrast i might change it to stone brick eventually but not right now because i can't afford that because i don't have enough coal and i really need to go on a mining session so we're gonna have a window here which means i gotta get back up oh man I should have chose the other side to do. It's all right. It's all right. No worries. No worries. So we're going to do a little window right here. So this is going to go here and there. Here is my huge, huge debate. And I think it'll make it look a lot nicer. But the problem is it's going to take a lot more quartz. So let me build this up and I'll show you guys what I'm talking about. All right, so I'm finally done. And they are always a zombie down there trying to get me. So I'm gonna have to go down there and kill it. I'm sorry, zombie, that it had to be like, oh my gosh, please don't fall and die like that. Please don't do it. Okay, ooh, ooh, you can't, you're not, you, you're no match for me, zombie, man. I'm gonna kill you every time. So this is the style I was thinking about going for my house. I'm not 100% sure how I feel about the windows. I was very like, ooh, I like it. So there's the first way I showed you guys. I could just put a stair underneath the main window and keep it like that. So kind of go for the bottom half. Or I could just extend the window and make it even longer and just leave it like it is. You know, don't add anything else. But I personally feel like that looks a bit strange when there's just boom and it goes to that kind of window there. I decided to take the cobblestone off because I didn't like it. So I'm thinking about using dark oak wood. So I'm going to go grab some right now and try to go to sleep while I'm at it because I'm tired of dying. And I also had one more question for you guys. Where I'm going to be building the house, I want to know how much of it do you guys want to actually see me build? Because I know it's a bit of a mix of our feelings when it comes to that some people are really like oh i want to see you build some people are more like eh just show us like what it looks like when it's done of course i'm not gonna do like the interior without you guys because i feel like you guys would like to watch that but as far as the exterior of the house do you guys want to see that or do you want me to just show you guys when it's done so make sure you let me know in the comments down below um if i don't really get an answer from you guys i think i'll kind of do 50 50 i'll have a lot of it done but i'll still do some of it on camera so that you guys could see it uh i don't mind either way so don't feel like you're gonna hurt my feelings by telling me the truth all right so let's put this here like that and then we're gonna take down this i'm gonna take down both of these here boop and a boop ba boop ba boop boop perfect oh! oh! creeper i hate them I hate those little burgers. They come over here thinking they could kill me and stuff. It's not nice at all. It really isn't. I would have liked to do a corner one, but that looks kind of strange. Ah, uh, I think the wood looks really good. But I don't know if that's just me having my own opinion. But I like the wood. We're going to try one more thing and then we're going to move on with our lives. We could just go like that. And then put this here if we don't want to do it all the way across. Do that. And do that and have it like that. I personally prefer it with a three all the way across. But I think for sure the dark oak looks so much better than the, the quartz on there. I think that looks really nice. It's a nice contrast from the light colors of the house. So let me know. What do you like better? The top or the bottom? And then I think for the side of the house, I'm going to do these little patterns here with the stairs. Like do the normal stair, upside down stair, normal stair, upside down stair. Because I feel like that looks really nice. And of course for the roof, it's just going to be lined with quartz. And then the top is actually going to be cobblestone. So we're not going to go with cobblestone after all because... I just didn't like it, to be honest. I did not like it one bit. So certain areas are gonna be easy for me because like this just needs to be filled in with clay and that is it. I wonder how many times I'm gonna screw up. 
I guarantee it's going to be like an infinite amount of times. Like it's going to be ridiculous. Look at all the blocks that are on the floor right there from all my mess ups. And that's only half of it. I messed up so many more times. It took me about 20 minutes to do that. Just to do that. Can you believe that? I'm never going to get this done ever. See, this is what I mean. Do you want me to? Are you sure you want me to do it on camera? <laughs> so then over here, again, we're going to do that same pattern. And I'm going to make all of them point outward. So point that way instead of some pointing this way, some pointing that way kind of thing. So it's just going to be the same thing all over again. So we're going to get our dirt here and I'll show you guys how I did this. It's just normal stair upside down normal. I love doing this though. Like, oh man, I was doing, I was just going to say I never mess up and guess what I do. I go ahead and I mess up. That's just not what I wanted. Boop like that yes i like it i like it a lot and then um i was thinking of adding this little like ladder detail i was gonna be all fancy schmancy and then i was like no it doesn't look right what i was gonna do is add like little stairs instead of trap doors on the side of the windows like this to be all artistic and cool what do you think of that what do you think i was just like i don't know about it so i'm just gonna keep them off for now because i wasn't sure I wasn't really sure. I gotta go feed my sheepy though so that they can make little sheepy babies. So right now, um, I need to go get some wheat. I might have some wheat already. I want little sheepy babies because I'm gonna need wool when I do my interior. So let's go inside. And sheepy is gonna have a baby, you guys. It's a special, special day. We're gonna have to come up with a name for sheepy. Should we call it pie? No, because sheepy pie is already a, a thing. Let's go. We only need a couple. <gasps> we need to decide who's going to make a baby with Sheepy. <gasps> That's a very special honor because we all know Sheepy is my favorite. Sheepy is my favorite sheep. Give me the wheat. Thank you. That's all we need. We just need two. All right, here we go. The moment we've all been waiting for. For little Sheepy baby. I want you guys to... Oh, no. Oh, snap. Crap, go pop. <gasps> Look, there's a zombie in there with my horses. Oh, no. Oh, no. Look at him. Oh my gosh, why are there so many mobs in here? Horsey, please stay away. Please stay away. Please stay away so I don't hit you. What the heck is hitting me? Don't tell me there's another one on this side. No, there isn't. Come at me, skeleton. I, You better not make me kill my horse. You better not. Oh, die. Yes. Okay, perfect. We got to put some torches in here. <gasps> Can we make sheepy? And we're going to change her name to Martha. Okay, so Martha. Oh, so Sheepy. I'm so, so Sheepy. I'm so sorry. Go make a baby. What color is it gonna be? What color? Oh, it's a little baby. There you are, you little cutie patootsie. Look at you, you little cutie patootie. Your baby is so adorable, Sheepy. I want you guys to leave a comment down below saying, "We love you, baby Sheepy. Welcome to the family." Oh, that means we can never kill sheep ever again because I just, I love them too much now. I love them too much. So I'm gonna go over further away so we can get a good angle of the house and then I'm gonna go ahead and end it here. So for our projects, we have a greenhouse. We've got a shed that's gonna be kind of like a little outdoor house for our storage room. We've got our house to build. So what do you guys think? I think definitely hands down we need to go with the dark wood but i think it's gonna look good i think it's gonna look good we gotta stay hopeful so let me know in the comments down below what do you prefer do you prefer the straight the stairs give me your opinions i don't mind it you could tell me but i hope you guys had fun watching don't forget to welcome little baby sheepy over there um and i will see you guys next time so if you enjoyed this episode make sure you leave a like comment and share and all that good stuff and i will see you guys next time bye